So good evening all. So let's know how to install Anaconda. Okay. So first of all, you have to open www.anaconda.com. Then select the specific version as per your operating system. Download it and simply install. It's very, very easy. Let's see. So first of all, let's see what I'll do. I will open www.anaconda.com. Let's open it, www.anaconda.com. So once I open www.anaconda.com, okay, it displays like this one. See, this is the Anaconda site. It's a popular tool for developing data science, machine learning, and AI-based application. Which one? Anaconda. Okay. So, <clears throat> So trust uh, earned over 21 billion downloads, just imagine, okay. So uh, we'll select the free download because uh, we don't want to pay. If you're in corporate sector, then uh, <clears throat> you're using for development purpose, then you can uh, choose the like uh, price version or paid version, but uh, we'll use the free version. So click on free download. So once you click on the free download, it'll ask you, to give some of your details, but I don't want any registration. Simply you just like skip registration. So once you click the skip registration, then it will give you distribution installers. Okay, what is distribution installer? What is mini Kona installer? So I select uh, this uh, distribution installer, and you can see here for different different operating systems, we have to install different version of Anaconda. So if you have, if you have Windows, I think most of the system of Windows. So you can go for selecting this one and this uh, 64 bit graphical installer which is uh, nearly 914 mb file okay and it uses python 3.13 which is the last mostly i think 3.13 is the latest version and if you have mac you can also select any uh, as per your system uh, configuration you can select mac and if you have linux also accordingly you can select the linux version but since most of the system are windows Simply you just download this one, 64 bit graphical installer. Just click download it, click on download, so it will download. It will take some time, this is a big file, okay. Once, so I have already downloaded it. So once you download it, how it look like, just see here. So once you <clears throat> download it, just see here. Let's say here. Just see here. This is Anaconda. What? Anaconda installer. Okay. Anaconda. This is the install file. You can uh, double click it. Simply double click at next. Simply double click. Okay. I have already installed. So this installation process may take like uh, 10 to 15 minutes. Okay. And once you double click on this file, it will nothing to select. Simply next, 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 next. Okay. And it will take around uh, 10 to 15 time minutes uh, depending on your processor speed and it will be installed. It is very, very easy. Okay. So nothing, remember one thing, nothing to select. Simply next, next, next. Okay. So once it will be uh, successfully installed, okay, it is like next, next, next. Okay. It will display like this one. Welcome to Anaconda uh, 3. Okay. 64 bit setup. Next, next, next. Nothing to do, nothing to select. Okay, that's all. It will take around 10 to 15 minutes depending on the speed. So once it is installed, so I have not initially because I have already installed it. So once you have installed it, then what will happen? You can use. Now Anaconda is ready. So how to know? So you can click the start button here. You can type here Anaconda. See, Anaconda Navigator. You can see Anaconda Navigator. You can click on this one. So it will open Anaconda Navigator. <clears throat> okay. So once it will open Anaconda Navigator, let's see what happened. It contains a lot of tools like Jupyter, Spider, lot of things, lot of things. So mostly the uh, like uh, we'll uh, uh, initially we'll prefer Jupyter Notebook. Okay. So we'll work on Jupyter Notebook. 
you can see here now anaconda navigator is open you can see different different uh, tools are there okay and uh, but basically what we will do is uh, jupyter node right now pie chart is there notebook this one jupyter notebook so i will launch this one this one jupyter notebook just click launch here because we will work on jupyter notebook let's see how it opens so now jupyter notebook is open okay launched here you can see this window will be displayed and you can see here new okay you click on this new you can select python so this is a very popular tool for writing python programs and uh, mainly for developing ai based application ai machine learning based application it is very very popular because it contains a lot of packages like numpy panda dotly lot of uh, packages are inbuilt here so it will be easier to develop such applications so that's why we are preparing this one so it's opening uh, my system is a little bit slow that's why let's see you can see here this is the jupyter cell where you can write programs let's let me write a program here simple program I write here a equal to 10 b equals to 20 c equal to a plus b and for it this is a simple Python program and you can click the run button here. The run button here, run or the shortcut is shift enter. Shift key plus enter <coughs> also you can do it. No problem at all. And let's say I'm writing another program. A equal to 10, B equal to 5, C equal to A minus B and print C. Run it. Shift enter. Or you can click the run button also here. So you can write multiple programs in Jupyter Notebook. No problem. And what are the other facilities? Why it is called a notebook? Because you can write a program. <clears throat> you also can write notes. You also can add images. You also can give headings. Okay. So it's very uh, user friendly. Let's see. So let's say I want to give a heading. How I can give a heading? Give a hash here, hash symbol with space here. Let's say I'm writing here. Welcome to Python soft LLP. Okay, give a hash, then space, then select here Markdown, Markdown, and now run this one. Got it? Now there's a heading. Okay, let's, let, let's uh, I am creating another heading. Let's say addition, hash, then space, then addition of two numbers. So, what to do now? Now make it as a Markdown, then run it. Let's start writing addition of two number program. Then copy this code and put it here. If anyone sees, okay, what is the program? This program is for addition of two number. That's all. Run it. Done. Now let's say, let me, uh, I want to, that means you can write code. See what the modes are there. Code, Markdown, and draw. Code means, this is the code, Python code. The modes will be code mode. You can run it. And uh, for heading and uh, heading, you have to give what? Markdown. And for let's say I want to add an image here. How to add an image? Simply <clears throat> what to do? Click this cell, make it as a markdown. Now, when you click on this cell, you can see the uh, solid markdown. Now, you go to your system, you can copy any image. Let's say I have to copy one image from here. I'll just copy an image and just paste it here. And run it. Got it. Very simple. Again, you just make a select markdown, then copy one image and paste it here, then run it. So you can add diagrams and images also. Let's say I'm writing how to write notes in Jupyter Notebook. If you want to write notes, let's say I'm writing here, okay. Welcome to Python Soft LLP. It's giving error. Let's say LLP. Okay. 
learn python ai ml etc so do you think this is a python code no this is the english sentence some notes i have to write some notes so obviously python cannot uh, run it it will be error because it uh, is this is not a python code so how it can run so this is meant for notes so how to make how to uh, maintain it is just make it as raw so when i am making it raw now run this one it will not run that means you can write notes here okay. normal english like this notes and if you want to save this file how to save this file you just click on file save notebook as here is on title 750 a lot of files are there okay you just make it let's say right uh, i like here um let's say right here i like here I like uh, whatsapp whatsapp on ai ml dot ipn dot save it it is saved whatsapp on ai let's see here so it is saved okay you can see here whatsapp on ai ml just close it so once uh, for the next time when you open jupyter notebook you can see first of all when you open jupyter notebook this window will see you can find it here you can see here whatsapp iit business sorry this is the previous whatsapp whatsapp on ai ml got it just click on this one you can see everything will be there it is auto saved you don't need to save again and again it's opening see here now okay these are the things i have done till now so i told you how to download and install anaconda and how to work with jupyter got it so please do it that's all thank you all